Kids Bumpies Frozen Pizza Reviews. Yeah! Welcome back to another Bumpy Pizza Review. Here we have the Red Baron again, another brick of uncrust. Uh, this one's just the cheese trio pizza, mozzarella provolone cheese blended with Parmesan cheese and parsley. And uh, that weight there, you see that? It's 17.82 ounces, so a little over one pound. This is what it looks like still in the wrapper, so nice. I'm glad that the cheese is actually all over the pizza. Good, I'm gonna do it a little bit differently this time. Gonna uh, try to put this one out on the smoker. All right, so as you can see, it is snowing out here tonight, but got the smoker, gonna set for 400. It's gonna go up and down, but uh, doing this over open flame. Uh, it says to uh, put this in the oven on the rack for 16 to 18 minutes. Since I'm putting this over open flame, I'll check it after like 10 minutes, um, but hopefully it won't burn. All right, so yeah, uh, 10 minutes, it was over the center, 400 degrees. Um, it did start to, I wanna show the bottom a little bit, it did start to kind of burn a bit there. So I did start taking it off to the side just a little bit. Um, yeah, a little bit more burnt than I would like, I guess. This is just an experimental thing. Um, so, so other than the kind of burnt crust, it smells a little bit smoky and uh, kind of, Kind of nice. Uh, we'll just cut into this. I can definitely smell. It's like a caramelization of the crust. This is definitely gonna crisp. Like I said, it's a, it's an experimental thing tonight. So there's no real ratings on this. Just wanted to see if doing that on the uh, smoker over the open flame would actually work. And uh, I'll probably throw some hot sauce in one of these slices too, just to see if that goes if it's edible, <laughs> even. But, I mean, overall, the top doesn't look bad. Um, just slightly well done there on the bottom. All right, so here we are. Uh, you know how I do it, <laughs> typically? I'm gonna eat the whole fucking pie. Uh, I'm not sure about this one. Like I said, it's an experimental night. Uh, if it's just too cr crappy, I'm, I'm not gonna eat. I'm not gonna eat it, but I am definitely gonna try a slice with some hot sauce on it. But let's uh, just pick up the first slice here. Definitely too well done on the undercarriage, so uh, I don't know. Open flame, maybe not the best idea. Cheers. It definitely adds a nice char flavor to, to the pizza. All right. Yeah, so I don't think I can eat the whole pizza on this thing. I mean, I've gone through this first slice, basically. Um, I'm going to have to redo, definitely redo this one. This is just a, a trial thing. Uh, dogs are hanging around, though. They definitely want to try some of this pizza. Um, yeah, uh, it's, it's burnt. I mean, if you like burnt crust, then this definitely works um, it does add a little bit of a kind of smoky um, note to the uh, to the pizza uh, to the cheese on this in this case since it's all cheese um, but yeah on top I mean it tastes like it's okay there's some sauce a uh, little get a little um, like an oregano or whatever the heck they have <coughs> as a spice in the uh, on the cheese um, so gotta definitely try this just cooking in the oven the regular way instead of messing around all right so as promised I guess some Frank's Red Hot Original here uh, I tried to find the least burnt um, next slice I guess that is it uh, and uh, yeah I'll just I don't know I'm not sure how much of this I'm supposed to put on but it's an experimental night right so here we go. Some out in that crust and stuff back there. Oh yeah. Okay. I hope that's enough. Yeah. I can definitely smell the hot sauce. The Frank's isn't too hot anyway, so.
All right. So, adding the, the Frank's hot sauce to it basically makes it taste like it's a, a, a buffalo chicken pizza without the chicken. Um, but yeah, the Frank's hot sauce definitely has that kind of buffalo kind of uh, flavor to it. You notice it's not the buffalo sauce. They do have a buffalo sauce one too. I don't know really what the difference would be. But, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll take a bite of the next one here. The, I mean, these are just like burnt, so I'll, I don't think I can do it, but. That was a bad idea, kind of. Um, I mean, it really didn't do much with adding any extra flavors besides burning the crust. So cooking it over flame out in the smoker, add a little bit of a kind of a smoke um, note to the top. Um, yeah, it's not something I'm going to do again. I've learned my lesson. Um, just do it in the oven like the frozen pizzas tell you to. Yeah, I'll uh, I'll revisit this uh, this Red Baron uh, cheese again. They also have a thin crust that you have to get to as well. But uh, so no rating on the Red Baron itself uh, for tonight. It was just an experimental thing, and uh, yeah, just open flame. At least at the temperature I chose. Maybe if the flame wasn't as high as it was going, maybe at lower temperature it might work, but. It's just not worth it. It's just not worth it. So cheers. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. <laughs>